Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Glorious Estates. And we're sorry about the hiatus that we had, but uh, just everything comes up. You know, life gets in the way. But in the meantime, we have bought many, many parcels of jewelry. And I wanted to do a treasure hunt, but luckily, um, I went through and picked out very select few pieces instead of just having a mounded pile here where we couldn't find anything of some of the best stuff that we've picked up in the last couple weeks. And believe me, there is some stuff in here that is really, really cool. So, and uh, let me tell you a short story about uh, something that happened last week. Sitting over at my desk with a pile full of jewelry going through it, customer comes in and looks at me and says, are you talking to the jewelry? And I said, yes, as a matter of fact, I am. And he says, well, is it talking back to you? And I said, yes, as a matter of fact, it is. And he didn't understand what I was talking about. So I picked up this beautiful little piece and I walked over to him and I said, here, hold this to your ear. And he picked it up and he put it to his ear and he could actually hear this thing ticking away. And he said, all right, that's weird. The jewelry is talking back to you. So let me show you this beautiful watch ring. And this is an extremely unusual piece because it is 10 karat gold on the band but the gold itself is gold filled. So we're not really sure how we're going to sell this, but the ring itself is a size, almost a size six, five and three quarters. And I'm going to have to kind of assume how much gold is in it, but let me get you a really good close up of this thing. Cause it's just so neat. So this year, if you crank it open is actually a working 1940s, 1950s style watch that has been beautifully added to a real 10 karat gold design band. So finding workmanship like this is very odd and unusual. It's, it's kind of like welding aluminum to steel. When you see, see somebody who actually puts real gold with plated gold. So how neat is that? So on this one here, like I said, I'm, we're kind of going to have to shoot from the hip on this. But I think this piece is cool enough to get 250, right? 250 for almost size six, 1940s, 1950s modified watch ring. Very, very interesting piece. I love, I love the strange, the odd, the unusual, the, the pieces that tell me a story. So the other one in here that really tells me a story, but it's incomplete is this one. Check that out. Now, what tells me the story about this one is it is a magnificently, magnificently, magnificent design for a tie tack. And yes, that is very, very sharp. But this goes in and around, and the diamonds on the handle are absolutely phenomenal. Now, this one here is set in 14 karat gold, and it's supposed to be priced at $9.99. Let me show you why, because the diamonds are phenomenal. Those diamonds do not belong in this piece. That center stone is actually about a quarter carat, it doesn't look like a quarter carat, rose cut. So these diamonds came out of a piece pre-1890 and then were made into this gorgeous tie tack, custom done, for somebody I'm going to guess in the 1960s or 1970s. So I love it when, when pieces tell me a story about how they've traveled. And in this case, it's from one piece to another. How neat is that? So our normal price on it is supposed to be $9.99. I'll tell you what, let's get it out of here tonight for $500. That's right, $500 for a... I'm gonna call it an interesting mix, but rose cut diamonds set in a custom made 14 karat gold tie tack. So cool. And, and you wouldn't have to leave it as a tie tack. I would imagine you could do tons of other stuff with it, but very fascinating piece. Absolutely love it. All right, so the next one here we got is a classic, very classic, probably 1930s, 1940s. Hang on, we'll get a better look on it. Yes, definitely in 1940s. That center stone in there is going to be right at a third of a carat total weight in 14 karat white gold. And it's normally supposed to be priced at 599 
Size 7. Perfect size 7. Get a good close-up of it. So that third of a carat is in this just phenomenal, truly, uh, not gone, Art Deco style. Size 7 filigree ring. $5.99. How about tonight? For $300. You heard me correctly. A third of a carat estate piece diamond for $300. You can't beg, borrow, or steal deals like this anywhere. Anywhere. And remember, I give you my caveat. If you see anything tonight, don't wait, don't delay. Because when you're looking at stuff here, we are not some big box chain outlet. You're looking at the only piece. So if you miss it, and sometimes these pieces get missed by seconds, please, please give us a call. The number's at the bottom of the screen, 662-781-8400. Or send us a, a messenger, and we'll do everything in our power to hold the piece, get it set up, get it shipped out to you as soon as we can. All right, let's keep rolling. For any of you that are very common watchers of mine, you know that I am a massive colored stone nerd. And one of the downfalls of being a colored stone nerd is whenever you see a mix of stones that you've never seen before, it automatically attracts your eye. So there's been a couple of these that I've shown in the past with things like jade and peridot mixed together, which you wouldn't think worked. And so when I saw this one, I mean, this one from across the room attracted me. Turquoise and rubies. How super unusual is that? First off, you don't see a large, large amount of turquoise set in gold at all. Normally, that is reserved for silver. And when they mix it with the rubies, wow, that makes it just even more odd. And this one here is in my tiny but mighty size. I love my tiny but mighty ladies. Get a good look up on it. So this one here is supposed to be priced at $7.99, but check out just the unusual combination and the swirl of the ring almost kind of gives it a magical effect where you think there's a swirl of turquoise and rubies and it's really not, it's just a concentric circle, but that swirl so adds to it. Love the little side shot on it, on it. and I'll tell you what, let's do it tonight for $4.50. That's right, $450 for this just superb uh, mix of stones, rubies and turquoise and 14 karat gold. Where else? Where else? Where else? Wow. All right, one of the things I've been getting asked for a lot lately, and if you all get a chance, go ahead and jump back to some of our old tutorials about, we did one specifically on silver bullion and silver coins. Um, and a lot of you are looking at this and thinking it's a silver coin. It's not. Actually, this one is even cooler. This one here is a One Noble 1985 Isle of Man Platinum, pure platinum bullion piece. I do not see a ton of platinum rolling through here. But this one here is very cool, very unusual. So I've maybe seen in the last two or three years one other one-ounce platinum piece, and it got snapped up just in an absolute heartbeat. So I'll tell you what I can do this for. I can do it for $11.50. Again, on bullion, you don't get a lot of markup. There's not a lot you can do. There's not a lot of room. But for this gorgeous piece of one noble pure platinum Isle of Man coin, that is cool. 1985. I've actually been to the Isle of Man, so, and no, it wasn't motorcycle racing. Uh, anyhow, all right, here's something really cool. I loved this piece. This is just so cool and odd and unusual, and it was hard to pass up. Now, y'all know that I have an affinity for older watches, and not necessarily as telling time, but more as pieces of jewelry. And this one here was hard, hard to, to pass up. Let me get you a better view of it. So the watch itself is not operational at this time. Um, so what I'm really planning on doing is pulling that watch piece out and doing something else with it. The two round diamonds on each side, upper and lower, are single cut quarter carat diamonds. Very unusual to see a single cut quarter carat diamond ever, yet alone in this piece from the 1950s, 1960s, that is what they did. 
So I need help from everybody. This is where project time comes in. I know y'all love project time. Um, what do you think we should do with it? Should we scrap the piece, pull the diamonds out, make earrings out of them? Should we pull the watch piece out, uh, set another colored stone in it? Should we, you know, turn it into like a floating diamond setup? I'm not really sure, but we're going to go ahead and pop this puppy open. We're going to figure out something to do with it. Please, uh, if you get a chance, give us a message. Uh, put something in the Facebook. Put something in YouTube that helps with our algorithm. It also helps us because I, y'all are the best designers that we have. We love you. Y'all have so much fun and y'all have the best ideas. So we love working with it. We love seeing what you can come up with because that is awesome. And if any of y'all are interested, please remember that you can come see our jewelry store and we have fun projects like this available that we haven't told anybody about. We have loose diamonds, we have loose colored stones, we have settings, we have everything else. We have professional semi-mounts, pieces like this that we can work with and work around and build custom pieces just for you. It's at 3016 Highway 51, suite number two in Hernando, Mississippi, right there at Oak Grove and 51. Come see us and we would love to take care of you. All right, let's do something else. How about something more petite, but very much affordable. Check out that. I really like this. So this one here is set in 10 karat white gold. And it has one very simple diamond in the middle. This it would make for a gorgeous little promise ring. Uh, something very, very cute, elegant, easy to wear for a gift for somebody who is, you know, a little younger. And it's in a size 6. Let's get you a good view on it. And normally with that single diamond there, it's supposed to be priced at 99. Tell you what, let's get it out the door tonight for about 60 bucks. That's right, $60 for real gold, real diamonds, just a very simple estate antique diamond ring. Very awesome. I like this so much. And remember that if you need this shipped to you, we can do it. We can do it. We can box it up. Send it, whether it's one pieces, two pieces, the whole shebang, the whole show, uh, for $10. We'll box anything up and ship it to you anywhere in the United States. So, don't forget, that's an option. Make sure you contact us. Give us a call. It's at the bottom of the screen. It's 662-781-8400. And just because I got to, I got to let the Colored Stone Nerd come out and play again. This one here is awesome. I'm normally not a super big fan fan of the yellow topaz but this one here simply catches my eye and i i will tell you why i believe it catches my eye um that is the closest coloration in a topaz i have ever seen to a yellow diamond um if you were going strictly by color that i hope it's a topaz i hope it's not a yellow <laughs> i hope it's not a yellow diamond that really is as close to a yellow diamond as you can see in a, in a topaz and that topaz coloration. So it's normally going to be priced at $5.99. It is a size 7. And again, in 14 karat white gold. Get you a good close-up on it. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. That is the exact distinct coloration of a yellow diamond. If you were going to fool somebody with a yellow diamond that is what it would look like i swear so what can we get you in this for not the 5.99 it's supposed to be how about 300 dollars? that's right 300 bucks very well built very hefty diamonds on the side are phenomenal just absolutely gorgeous and you can see the light bouncing off reflecting off those diamonds and popping popping out of that yellow yellow stone it is gorgeous just phenomenal 300 bucks give us a ring please 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 before this is gone do not miss this ah here we go since we're since we're proud of our antiques i have to bring this one i gotta bring this one up um if you uh have watched any of our previous shows you know we actually did an entire show just on cameo so let's get a better look on this one and we'll see what we're working with so that is vintage, that is hand etched, that is not machine etched, in carnelian, and it is set in 10 karat gold. 
So this one here is going to be from the 1920s to the 1940s. And our normal price on it is supposed to be $349. I tell you what, this one can be worn as a pin or as a pendant. I can do it for $200. That's so right, $200 for a true vintage cameo, real carnelian, hand carved, not machined, not anything like that. Just a beautiful piece of history. We were talking earlier about uh, pieces of jewelry talking to us and pe pieces of jewelry having history, telling us their history. I would love, love to know the history and the story on this because it is awesome. $200 worn as a pendant or worn uh, as a pin for Carnelian Vintage Cameo. like that. Awesome. Very, very cool. Very, very nice. All right, where do we want to go? I, we got to go here. All right. For any of you that were looking at these and very curious, stackables have become all the rage. Um, and since we do do a lot more in estate jewelry, we don't see as many stackables. So when this one came up, I absolutely loved it. Hang on, let me get a good view of them. They are set in 14 karat gold. And they are, one has rubies, one has emeralds, and one has sapphires. And let's get your price on them. So they are going to be a size six. All three of them are the exact same size. We are going to sell these as a set because they really honestly belong together. Uh, now you can wear one, you can wear two, you can wear all three, you can mix and match. And that is really kind of the cool thing about stackables. And it's supposed to be priced at $9.99. I'll tell you what. How about we knock that in half? How about 500 bucks? So right, $500, not for one ring, not for two rings, three 14 karat gold rings featuring real diamonds and real colored stones. Awesome, very neat. I love this effect, I love that you can mix and match, wear them together, wear them separate. All right, here we go. Going back into our estate stuff, I love our estate stuff, just got some great stuff in. So this one here is marked in 14 karat gold, it's a little bit newer. And it is a size uh, seven and three quarters. All right. So we got a little bit of a larger one. And supposed to be priced at $4.99. Somebody actually described this as a peacock ring. Right? And I, I, I can see it. I, I, I give them every, every props for naming it the peacock. Uh, I tell you what. We haven't done the deal of the day yet. I, I would love to make this estate piece a true deal of the day. How about half price? That's right, 250. 250 for real diamonds and real gold. And I'm gonna say this ring is from the 50s or the 60s, possibly a little newer from the markings on the inside, but it certainly does carry that estate flavor, that kind of art deco feel that is awesome. I love it very much. Gorgeous, beautiful piece. All right, let's keep rolling. Uh, let's see. Oh, all right. We haven't done any earrings tonight. So when I get these, hang on, hang on. Check this out. I, I, uh, these actually really confused me because I didn't know what they were. And then I took them apart. And believe it or not, this is an earring guard for a set of ball earrings. So these are actually three, with the backs, they're three pieces. Hang on. Let me get a better view on them. These I just thought were really cool. I don't get a whole lot of super, super nice um, earring guards. So they're in 10 karat gold and they're supposed to be priced at <laughs> uh, $59.95. These are not very heavy, but they are extremely elegant. Very, very nice. And I'll tell you what, how about $40? That's right. $40 for three piece. That's the Guard the earring in the back, a uh, pair, just, I, I like it. I don't know. It's, it's something very interesting, very unusual, not something we commonly see. All right, let's keep rolling. We've got a couple more minutes, I think. Uh, let's see. How about this one? Okay. Yes, yes. Admittedly, my colored stone has come, nerd has come out to play a lot more than usual, but I really, really like some of the stuff. Love this little pearl and sapphire. Let's check to make sure they are sapphires. But, 
Yes, those are sapphires. This is set in 14 karat gold with this gorgeous little pearl. It's probably about a seven millimeter. And it's normally going to be priced at, I got to get my calculator to work. Voila. Uh, it's supposed to be priced at $6.99 and a size six and a half. Get you a really good look up on it. I love the little filigree design on it. That's just super classy. Um, like I said, again, a very art deco feel. Supposed to be $6.99. How about we do it tonight for $400? That's right. Just the gold in here is worth $400. You cannot beg, borrow, or steal prices like this. Can't walk into jewelry stores. Can't walk into chain stores and find these kind of deals. You can only find them here at Glorious. So if you see something you like, if something's really catching your eye, please, please give us a call. 662-781-8400. Do it before you miss out. And pick up these beauties while you can. They're absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. All right, well, one of the things we haven't done a whole lot tonight of is men's rings. And this one here, just I had to throw in there. It was kind of cool, very interesting. And I just, I don't know, I liked it. It's got a white gold ring in 14 karat gold with a small yellow gold cross in the center with a simple round diamond. And that's in the size 10, so I'm stand, standard men's size 10, uh, you know, not me, but uh, for most people. And it's supposed to be priced at $549. I'll tell you what, where can we get it tonight at? How about we get you in this beauty tonight at $300? That's right. Very simple, but super elegant. Very nice cross with a single diamond. Get you a good side view and an underneath view of it. If you're worried about it rubbing, if you're worried about it breaking, it's incredibly thick and the inside is smooth. It does have this just gorgeous look to it. Really like that. That's a lot of fun. Something he can wear, he can take with him, have with him. Yes, this is it. This is it. Give us a call. Give us a message. Let us know you want that. You need that in your life. All right, we haven't done any real necklaces tonight. How about that one? I, I, I love when they do some of the tricolor gold stuff. It's really, really gorgeous. So this one here is set in 10 karat gold and it has a tricolor uh, pendant on it and concentric circles. So hang on, let's get your price. It's supposed to be $2.99. Let's see. How about 160? And that's not 160 for the pendant. That's 160 for the pendant and for the necklace. You will not find deals like this anywhere. I really like that. That is so cool. Figure out how long the necklace is. Uh, size 18. So $160. Just gorgeously well made. Tricolor concentric circle pendant on an 18 inch link necklace. Yeah, that'll work. That'll be a great gift for anybody at any time for any reason. Uh, how are we doing on time? Okay, cool. We still got some time. I love it. All right, how about bracelets? Because we haven't done bracelets yet. Oh, yeah. Wow. Colored stones. Let's get a better look on it. Yes, you can fault me all you want. Real do, real rubies. Real diamonds and actually very good colored rubies. So I like that. So set in 14 karat gold. It is a 7 inch bracelet. Supposed to be priced at 700. Tell you what. Double row rope around round brilliant diamonds and red rubies. With a gorgeous little clasp. How about 400 bucks? That's right, $400. 14 karat gold, very nice. Extremely elegant. This would be good for everyday wear. It has a fabulous little clasp on it. Hang on, let me uh, get it untwisted. <laughs> Football player hands and deal with jewelry all day long. Yes, I don't know how I do it. I don't know why I do it. But while uh, you can actually hear it clasp so that's a very good sign i like that 
this one here will hold up, is well built, meant for everyday use. I like it. All right, let's do one last one. And this is, again, going back into our odd and unusual category. And y'all are looking at these going, hmm, what are, what are those? They're very yellow. Yes, these are very yellow. This, these are traditionally when they're colorated like this, it's going to be 21 or 22 karat. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm wrong. It's 96.5% pure. So a 23 karat is, that's it. These are 23 karat gold. So almost pure, 96% pure gold. All right, they're supposed to be priced at 225 just because of the gold in and of itself. I mean, this is like somebody handing you a gold bar. Do not see these. But I tell you what, we can get these out of here tonight for 140, 130. We'll do 130 on them. How's that? Um, they do not have any backs. You would be hard pressed to find high carat gold backs, but you could use either standard backs or plastic backs on these. But if you're looking for a piece that nobody else has, yeah, you found them. This is nobody else has these. Trust me. Very unusual, very neat, and something that it would be a great conversation starter and uh, a, a way to show off. I like it. Anyhow, thank you very much for joining us. I'm so glad, so glad y'all joined us. Uh, as I always say, thank you for giving us your time. I know it's, it's one of the most valuable things you have, so you spending your time with us is something that we absolutely love. Um, if there's anything you need, please, please don't hesitate to call us. Let us know what you got going on. We'll do everything in our power to help you out. And in the meantime, thank you, thank you, thank you. And we'll see you next time. Everlasting and true. It's all because of you. That smile sure looks good. That smile sure looks good